So the idea for the play first came to me from a photograph uh, from an old library book. And it's a photograph of the, the highway, and it's this incredibly dangerous road. It's the highway between Kabul and Jalalabad in Afghanistan. Then about two years after that, uh, a reporter from the New York Times visited, did a series of articles. And then he included a picture with the first article of a little boy, and he was wearing a green traffic vest, and he was holding up a green, like kind of crushed Sprite bottle. This boy and other boys like him, who are called uh, Pepsi bottle boys, they stand on the side of the road, and when traffic is clear up ahead, they'll wave their green bottle and they work for tips. It was the idea that in the middle of all this chaos, that you had this little boy, and that this little boy had so much hope. For me, that was the play. Golden Thread Productions is the country's first theater company focused on the Middle East. Our mission manifests itself in two ways. One is really supporting artists of Middle Eastern descent, like myself, like Youssef Al-Gindi, like Mona Mansur, like Betty Shamia. Um, another one is to work with writers of non-Middle Eastern descent, like Kevin, um, to write about the Middle East in a culturally specific and truthful manner. Working with Golden Thread has been absolutely amazing. Uh, they've given me freedom to play, to make mistakes, and with that given me just instrumental support. Kevin has been an amazing partner in getting the play right and his hunger for that, his hunger for getting in the room with Afghans and learning from that, letting them tell their stories true to their words and then finding a way to funnel that through his own vision into this play has been very inspiring.